Blessings, Lafayette family and Facebook friends. My daily message for Saturday, January 21st. And I remind you, lots of great stuff is at FountainChurchTallahassee.org. And join us tomorrow, Sunday the 22nd, for a Kirkin of the Tartans at 10.30 a.m. together with the St. Andrew Society of Tallahassee. Join us. My scripture today is Mark 16, verse 1. When the Sabbath was passed, Mary Magdalene, Mary the mother of James, and Salome brought spices so they might go and anoint him. This is the word of the Lord. Did you know what they discovered in Israel? Archaeologists, biblical archaeologists, discovered what they believed to be the tomb of Salome, the wonderful companion of Mary, the mother of Jesus, one of the women who went to the tomb of Jesus with the spices to prepare the body and saw that the stone had been rolled away. The early church believed that Salome assisted Mary in the birth of Jesus. Well, we're not sure, but we know that they were close. It was obviously a place, a pilgrim site, this tomb of Salome, and there was evidence that there were some items meant to be sold as souvenirs. And even after the Muslim conquest of the Holy Land, the pilgrimages evidently continued, and there are even inscriptions about Salome in Arabic at this site. I believe that this shows us the power of faith. No matter what earthly circumstances take place, the faithful will still look to the Lord and revere and remember the saints. I believe that this also shows us that we can get along with others, even if it's sometimes uneasy, even if our religions or our traditions are a little at odds. We know by faith in Jesus Christ that we will live, that we will have abundance, and we're called to share that good news. Let's remember that there were those who practiced the faith openly and boldly, even when circumstances changed and were topsy-turvy. For these turbulent times, let's remember to stay the course and be faithful, and to remember those who have gone before us, but most especially the love of Jesus. Let us pray. Lord, we're grateful that they found such a tomb. It reminds us of the faithful, those who were there at the beginning, but those who passed along the traditions, those who were willing to be public with their faith, even in challenging times. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ.